Welcome back to Pelantis Plays. Today we are once again playing some Diablo 4. Uh, we got our Ice Sword here. Uh, and today we are going to really push to try to get all of these. All of these little ladies, these uh, Altars of Lilith. So, uh, we're just gonna take a little tour of doing all of them. So, uh, we're gonna start here. Um, we are at, uh, Obershad, no, uh, Nevesk. And, uh, this was the first one that we got. Um, and then, just go over here, up a little bit past. Uh, the uh, the city here, and we were able to find another one right up here. So wonderfully, we got these two. These were pretty out in the open, not too difficult, not too difficult. Now there are uh, a couple more that I haven't gotten yet, one of which is over here. Is that over here? Uh, yes, kind of over here. Up and around. And we just run, run, run. Should be up here. Ah, there it is. There it is. Hey, and I have more dexterity. I'm more dexterous. Superbly dexterous. Another one. No. Actually, there's one. Up here. Do this thing where we wrap, where we wrap, wrap around and it goes through this little area here, and there she. Hey, my intelligence! I'm so much smarter, and I get a pair. Oh, hey, and we open up another one. Frozen enemy grants you a maximum life barrier. I guess the only one is Ice Ball. And then... We want, yeah, ice. We also want to get this. So, oh my. That's difficult. Cold damage. Which is still non physical. Actually. This is probably the best.
Okay. Uh, let's see here. We're gonna run around. So those are all the areas. Those are all the places that have um, little filters in the beginning area. We got four. Next, we're gonna go to Dobrev Taiga. Uh, and we're gonna hit Margrave. Now, let's see, there are three in Dobrev Taiga. Uh, one's here, which we already got, so we'll we'll take a look at that one in a second. The other one is just out of town here. I dodge all these werewolves. Just over here. There. She is. And more willpower. Yay! I've got the will. Uh. Okay, and then. Oh, I can The horse. Again, I can't climb up with the horse. Too much climbing. Okay, and then there's this statue we found here. It wasn't too difficult. Hello. Uh, and then we come back around. Hey, we found a new quest! I'm looking for these quests. Go around, go around. I'm up here. We're not going to deal with this. Thing at all, we are. Oh, ah. Just trying to get out here, and then up here, there should be a statue. There. Ah, more murmuring ovals. Okay, very nice. I am using a map to do this because it's faster. I just got tired of hunting for them. It's fun, but um, I guess you have to do this before like a certain point. Otherwise, it won't carry over. So those are the three that we have there. Next, we're going to go to Gale Valley. Over here, I found one. Two more. that I could have sworn that I had really looked for. But... One is... believe I didn't find. It's right next to this altar here. But gotta keep a better eye on it. And then the other one is up here. Run! Run! Fast as the wind, my young friend. It's a jump. It is a jump. What? What? 
I love it when the horse jumps. Why didn't it jump? Oh. Me feel so sad. Altar here? There's no altar here. What are they talking about? Ah, there it is. More dexterous. Then... Then we have to do the frigid expand. This is one I was not... That There's a statue here. I was not really looking forward to doing this. It's so big. I'm just not sure where all of this is. Taking a long time to search through this. Okay. There we go. Murmuring ovals, very nice. Next one, like here, I think. It is a very expansive expanse. More willpower. Should help me with all of my stuff. All of my stats that I have. Okay, so the next one is. Now you can see most of these, you can kind of guess where they are, I guess. All these little nooks and crannies. They are. And they will generally be. Okay, another one. Next place on the map is. Oh, this one. I already got. Take a look. This is a nice little place for a little. get from that okay and that's all of them in the bridge of expanse now we've got one in the loink right here where is the closest we're gonna go to the bear tribe and then take our go way down and get that one little. Should have gotten it on our way through the first expanse, but you know, what happens? Okay, I think it's funny how you can dash in town, but you can't 
right, spur the horse. All right, it's like a little village, but not a village because there's no waypoint. House. Oh, hello! Strength, we have become stronger! Okay. Here. Oh, that one I never would have found. It's interesting, still, still cannot... Nope, cannot, cannot do that. Nope, but once we're through the gates... Oh! We can open her up. Talk about the freedom. Talk about the joy. Oh. There's a bear! The Arctic kind. weird place. It doesn't even look right. It looks kind of slanted. Looks like they just kind of stuck it in there. Why would they do that? Okay, and then that one here. Thank you very much for the people who found all of these, by the by. really done that in any sort of a timely fashion. Strength again! And then the last one... We already got the frigid expanse. Now we gotta do this. Overpass. It has quite a few, and there's one in Core Dragon. Dragon. So we're gonna start with this. The swinger. Pretty nice. Again, it looks a little... See how it's like a little sideways? It looks just a bit weird. Almost ready to fall into that pit, I guess. But... Uh, go here.
this is some kind of a town or something. Old Keep. Stronghold. That's right. One, yeah, you can't even really see. You just saw a red glow. Bye bye, guy. Rolling, rolling, rolling through. Gotta keep those little statues coming. setting super interesting there and then the last one is oh the one that i already got down here by the road take a look at that one we're gonna have to go anyways in that direction So I think I was just following up the, uh, riding up the road here. I saw it, probably. It's right on the road. Yeah, I mean, how can you miss it, right? Uh, the red light. You can't hardly see it now, but, like, if there's that red light in there, yeah. Okay, next, uh, we got the Pallid Blade, so, uh, this one. It was one that we already had. Check that out. I guess this is not the, uh, most optimal, optimal route to get them. I'm just going through each area. way that I will know for sure yeah and I checked out like this house and I was like it's gotta be in there there's gotta be one in there okay and then uh there is another one over here Move through the spiders and Goatman. Uh, running so fast, we fight nothing.
ones in the houses are kind of cool. I think this one's in the house as well. Like, back... Yeah, this was a cool little... Like, back here, and there's like a little... Area. Can't really see it, you have to like, know. Not through really stuff. And then, uh, there's another one. We're making pretty good time. We're almost done with the... Obels. It. Yeah! We're a little... Ultra Lilith Seeker. We completed all of them in the, uh... Fractured Peaks region. Hmm. Nice. Nice. Okay, now we gotta go to Skull's Guard. Ooh, that's gonna take a little while. Uh, so we'll start in the Highland Wild. That's where the uh, the Fat Goose Inn is. I love this place. By the by, I've always got those two guys duking it out right in front. Ooh, 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 ooh. The uh, the fight that never ends. I searched this area too, and I I only found the one. That's actually the first one that we're gonna go see here real quick. Oh, but I gotta gotta see my guys. What should we call these guys? One of them has to be Gerald. Can you tell the difference? One of them's wearing like a. Is wearing like an apron type thing, and another one is wearing like a shirt, a sleeveless shirt. So we'll call this guy Gerald, the one that's wearing like the more clothes. Gerald. That's this guy's name. Gerald. Gotta be some really. Gerald and Billy Bob. Yeah. Gerald and Billy Bob, okay. All right, Gerald and Billy Bob, you guys have some fun. I know you're doing your thing. Oh yeah, we are too. We're about to checking out all of the statues today. Now this is a nice little area. Look. The, the statue has a view of the river. The very surrounded by nature. Okay. The next one. I knew there was something here, but I didn't know exactly where. Oh, I know. I knew there was one down there. There's just so many little nooks to check out. Probably ran by it like seven times. Yeah, 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 because it's right here. Good, okay. Boost my intelligence. That's nice. All right, and then we've got this little area here. Okay. Interesting. It tends to be in either... Like... Fairly large little extra areas, or in little things like this. Have to kind of pay attention. Next.
get around that bounce. They really put a lot of time into these maps though. I'm very I'm very happy they did. It really feels like a full-on world. And uh in the expansions they put even more areas in. Of trees there. Be cool. Uh, this one is like here. No. Here. That other place is like uh, there's some some lava area. Yeah, the scar. Fight Gaspar, Built Bane, and then he will give you Crushed Beast Bone. Get on my horse. Increased by two. I've gotten like 10 strength by now, so I'm so strong. Okay, and then uh, the last one in the area. job with the quill spikes. Now, um, for the, for the first season, I'm kind of unsure what to do. Um, I might do a barbarian, um, just because go we can go to the shrouded moors next I haven't gotten any little altars in there um but I'm not sure so if you guys know or have any idea about like what's a good build um let me know uh and I can I Maybe I'll just do whatever the, uh... Yeah. I just kind of skip through this area. I do like the, the... The story... Like, the whole quest line of you going into the... Area where the half... Like, the guy's half body is to a tree and then you have to kill him like when and you get his dog for a little bit to follow you that's a really cool little quest i would play that quest for sure whoa
But this village here is bad. It was pretty un inconsequential. I didn't. Riding, I don't actually have to disengage. Very nice. Okay, no, oh, 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 yeah, it's over here. Don't really need. little it's homey a little bloody but you know that's homey for Lilith nice little area okay and then uh, we're gonna go to Mordain Lodge oh, and get this one because it's on the way anyways another one that is very close by but this whole area this whole storyline was super cool I would recommend it again But to be honest, I'm not sure if I'm going to opt out of the quest or not. Ooh, ooh. Treasure Goblin. These little ducky places. They're, they're cool. Although I don't understand why little dogs. Um. Wait. Bugs. And then just around the bend, I think this guy is doing the same thing. Up here. At this little altar. You have strange presence gazing deep. What does it say? Most of the inscriptions have been lost time a few. Greet death, open arms. And then just back up here. Of course, this is a cool area. Wow, this is nice. I like this. Hey. They like spawned out in the thin air. Okay. Uh, the next one we got is. Oh, it's barely, barely in the air.
Oh, cool. This is also pretty cool. A little house, a little broken church area. And... Last. He's the one that I already found. can go to that one. The... The other one's by up over there. This is another house one, I think. The house blink. Hey, get off my lawn, kids. Care if you have bones. And the next one is Oh really? It's right by the dungeon and I didn't see it. So that Literally right next to the video I saw it and I was like, oh, I'll get it when I found it. Oh, are gonna get eaten by spiders can't can't be helped good luck though to uh, stick around and listen to your complaints. That is an empty, isn't it? Not much attention. Do the ones at the north first and then I'll come back down. Okay. We are doing pretty good actually. We may actually do a, a tour of all of the altars within the hour and a half for our dream. So that's gonna be pretty good. Oh, 
has a little wooden shack around it. Nice. Okay, let's see the next one it's gonna be we are just gonna run all out gotta try and get it I see I saw it. Okay, run away. Next one is up the coast just a little bit. This one's like in the water even that's a pretty cool place too the coolest one so far though i think is the one that has like little on the hill you have to go up a couple times to get to it i like that one a lot okay next one is up here south is so slow like side to side seems faster north seems fine south oh this is a pretty little area actually still like the one still like the other one better actually um That's all in the North Shore. We've got the Wailing Hills we already did. The next one is here in the Emerald. Actually, like, kind of the same distance away from here. Real quick. Come on, get out of my way! Stupid monsters. Cross country. Avoiding the major food. And 
and next thing One more, and then we're gonna go to the downs real quick. One more, like, you're not. Still are in town. You know there's monsters everywhere. Okay, that's interesting. Very big town. Okay, so we're gonna go over here to the downs. Bill says I'm in town. A huge town. should be able to follow me up right? they just oh, I actually spent quite a bit of time in this area I'm surprised I didn't. Okay, so that's the downs, and then the last place, the last that we got the stuff. Oh, cool, another Is, uh, the Western Lowlands. So we're gonna go to the manor and we'll go get all this. That's everything in the north. Oh no, we've got the deep forest here too. Uh here is one. There's the Bellscar took a long time. Jeez. Fractured Peaks was so small compared to compared to this. No, are you somewhere? Is you? Ah, there it is. Then. 
got another one. No, I will not. Be stopped by your barrier. Just two out in the open, right? Oh, right behind this tree. Why did that have to put the tree right in front? It would look, it would look so pretty. Bad. They shouldn't put this tree. Okay. Well, there's another one. In the deep forest here. One right outside and one actually even inside it. I think I got the one that's right outside. One of those ones where you have to like crouch under. One inside the town is there. Cool. Let's descend into the darkness. That's a pretty cool spot too. Like that one. Other one down here. Speed, and then we're gonna go all the way down there. 
Luckily, there's a there's one um, dry steps area pretty close by that. Travel too much. Follow our GPS here. Cool, okay, so if we look here, Fractured Peaks, all. Falls Guard, all. Good, next we're doing Dry Steps. We have three, 33 left to go. Ooh, these areas are getting bigger. Might be able to finish it all. Okay, let's, we're in the, the Katama Grasslands. First. three in the Tuma Rift, so that'll be about two in the Tuma Rift, one, five, trying to be as efficient as I can, of course. Also trying to make sure I get all of them and I know exactly which one. Those greed shines are fairly used, in my opinion. Wish they were just anything else. And there's a statue. Huh? Nice little place. Um, but I'm glad I got that. This one looks like it might be kind of. This one I'm not that impressed. With. That little cave thing was nice. I think the I think the one on top of the mountain is over just because there's that other thing there and those uh, there's like another statue that those intrigue me. This is kind of a cool little area. Oh, 
up here. Okay. Uh, let's. See. Next, we're doing the Kuma Rift. And that, that's the first one. I found it. There's another one in there. A bit further away, a little bit. Suma Rift here is so windy. I think I saw that area and I was like, uh -huh. Or no. Super obvious. Main. Right, right. The other one is here. I felt like we were making good time when we were doing the, the fractured peak. I guess it's just so small. My steps is huge. I remember this area. This is a fun little area. This is the one where you like go through the guy's house and he's got his own like uh, thing here. I was looking for altars too. I was Next one that I should do is probably so far away. I think actually it's probably faster for me to go to your face retreat right ride from there. The Tuma Rift is just too windy. It's a cool little area though. This statue is kind of like by uh, in the middle of nowhere. These backwards ones, I'm not, I don't like, they're, you don't see the detail and it's really hard to see the... The light. Okay, Onyx Watchtower is here. Uh, we can go there first, and then there's like... Targari Craig, one of them. Just because there's one more down to the south and then go over. Jaha Basin. Jeez, there's so many. Okay. And this is kind of all, I'm trying to be a little bit more efficient.
I don't think we're gonna actually get to all of them. Kinda crazy. Don't love these. Yeah, that's that's out. Another one. as well as quest. Kind of cool. Down, down. There's Lewis devotee here. Okay, this is an all right little place. Next one. Right here. We'll have to do Jaha Basin. And then I'll go up to Chantar Ridge. Akabe. They're all pretty nice. In a nice little concentrated area here. again. Can't hardly see him. And then the last one is through here. Good. These are more spread out in the Champar Ridge. Oh, 
we'll get the one up at top. And then we'll come back down. I might be able to finish dry steps today. I don't think I'll be able to finish all of them. Gold's guard is big. That, that was a lot bigger than I thought it was. again. Come on. Second one. the little statues there. Uh, next, I'm going to go to the first wave. So we hit an overlook. Close. close to each other and then Mm-hmm. 
need to go. And then here, got a two, one. Oh, this is exhausting. Next, we got the Untamed Scar. There's kind of a way to do this. Okay, do that. Girandi! Hello, Girandi! in the field to take that there's only one Ultra of Lilith. barrier. Nice, nice job, guys. Field. Ah. All the cows are gone. So, 
one paragon point unlocked. Hallelujah. I've got one last. Any paragon points that I unlock? That one doesn't actually. Okay, so we got Temple of Rot, Untamed Star. This, let's go here first. One, only one altar in the fields of hatred and it's pretty close. We can zoom by and go do the scarred post and the dindy flat. Done with the dry steps. Okay, so it's run so fast. And then here, go all the way across Space, but it's also a bit weird, huh? Last one here, the here, which we got. So, I uh, yeah, let's... oh, hey.
remember this one was even that. It's kind of in a nice little area here. But you can't hardly see it. Okay, and then uh, the Dindy Flat. Uh, there's no way to go by horse. There's no like quick waypoint or anything into the Dindy Flat. Sadly, now, all these maggots would be a bit dried out, wouldn't they? Hot, hot sun. Indie flats. Hello. Who are the flats? Check. Oh, it's under, underneath the bridge. Saw uh, just a barely. It's kind of dangerous. Okay, the next one. point very good and last one dry steps, right? What? You missed one? Okay, let's see. Yes. There. There, there, there. Yeah, the Fractured Peaks took us like 20 minutes, and then the other two took us like 40 each. <laughs> so... It'll probably take us another 40 minutes. This is kind of a cool area. Wow! Oh, I like this. This is okay. This is the next. This is the best one so far. That's super cool. Look at this. So nice. Like it. I'm glad that that was uh, one of the last ones that we did. Okay. Uh, so I think that and. 
that one, and then this one, this altar up here, uh, in the uh, next to Korbach. Yeah, this one was really cool. Oh, is Korbach still dark? Yeah, it's not. Maybe it's always dark in Korbach. Of light. Let's go back and see it in the light. It was kind of dark. Let's compare that one, the last one that we saw, with this one. I'm just very curious. Super cool. No, this one's still better. Look at that. You got a little Stonehenge thing there. Broken bridges. This is still the coolest one. You got you got two climbs to get to it. Got some energy. I thought there was Stonehenge area. Is this the one that I said was the coolest one? Maybe this is the one. I thought it was. I like the one with the... Uh... I remember it had a... Uh... Another temple. Sort of. I thought right here it had like a statue. This is super cool. Oh, yeah, this is the best one. For sure. Okay, so looks like um, all we have left in Skull's Gun is uh, four quests and, uh, well, 15 dungeons. Fractured Peaks, uh, got everything but, uh, what? Five dungeons and six quests. And for the Dry Steps, got a ton of dungeons left. Um, but we don't have too much more left to do for the Renown. We got about ten side quests. Uh, so next is gonna be Halazar and Kedistan. We'll get these two little statues knocked out um yeah, that's gonna be about 60 there they look to be the fractured peaks is a bit small so they look to be about the same size as dry steps i think nah skull skull gun is bigger than Hauzar, and i think dry steps is about the same size Olfin is the was the biggest. Hedgestan is a bit is a little big too. But it's a little bit smaller. Our hell is our so the same size as price steps. So shouldn't take us too long to be able to get that all the rest of the statues done next time. And then uh, we can try to get the side quests done. We are we are pretty close to getting all the extra Paragon points. We just need to level, 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 level. I don't know what I'm gonna do for that. I'll probably just try to find some good dungeons and uh, keep on doing them over and over again. Um, but yeah. Uh, let me know again, uh, guys, uh, what you think would be best for, um, um, 
you to there. Uh, what you guys think would be best for uh, the uh, season one build? Um, I don't think it's gonna be source. Sork. Um, I'm I'm pretty be okay. Like I'll I'll probably keep leveling this one up, you know, until season one starts. But um, I don't want to I want to try something else out. See how it works. Anywho, uh, thank you all for watching very much. If you like this content, please like, follow, and subscribe for more. Uh, check us out next time where we will be finishing all the Lilith, uh, the altars of Lilith. And uh, after that, maybe doing some side quests um, and some dungeons. But until then, uh, that'll be on Friday. Uh, so five days from now, Friday, Asia Pacific region, Thursday, um, Europe and US, I believe. Uh, so catch me then. Same time. Uh, I hope y'all have a good week. Talk to you later. Bye bye.